Today I'm going to be disassembling this 2019 BMW X3 LED headlight. You can see that it's been pretty smashed up. Half the lens is already missing, so I'm going to go ahead and tear this down and we'll take a look and see how it's constructed and what's inside. So first thing I'm going to do is cut off the rest of this lens and then we'll start the disassembly. So I've got the lens removed and now all we really need is a T20 Torx driver to finish out this disassembly. So I'm going to start by removing this top plastic piece. There's going to be one, two, and three T20s across the, the top of this. So got the top plastic piece out of the way. Now we're going to remove the bottom. And on this one, there's going to be just two T20 screws, one in the middle and then one on the outside corner. Oh, there's actually one more here on the inside corner. Um, looks like I may have to remove the inside right here. So we removed that one T20 screw and then that came out. There's a little wire connector here. Here's the, the wire clip holding on the, the, the inside light here. So there, here is one more, a fourth T. And then with that out of the way, with that fourth screw holding the bottom on, we can now remove the bottom bezel. So now we have access to the projector and the turn signal. So we're going to go ahead and remove the turn signal bowl, reflector bowl. There is a T20 here on the top. It appears that this is connected to the projector bezel. Alright, so the projector bezel is held on by one, two, and three T20 screws. And once we pull this out, we can actually see that this inside one is completely fake. So there's only one projector in this X3 headlight. Now with, with the bezel removed, now the turn signal reflector will come right out and now we have access to the projector and the wire harness. Now before I start removing this, I want to turn it around and I want to pop out the, the wire, the external wire connector. And to do this we just take a flathead screwdriver and just kind of push around the edges to release the clips and push in with your thumb and then once it's released it will slide inside of the headlight and from here to release this wire harness there are looks like quite a few T20 screws holding the wire harness in various spots throughout the headlight so I'm going to go ahead and start removing these T20s to loosen the wire harness So here is a plastic cover that is preventing access to the wire harness. Looks like there's two, there's gonna be two T20 screws here. I'm gonna go ahead and remove these. So here we have just a, just a wire clip. So I'm just gonna grab hold of this and let's give it a, a good pull. And that will release and connected to the projector is going to be two wire clips there's one and there's two so now we got most of the wire clips out of the way 
looks like a lot of the rest of the wiring is behind the projector so I'm gonna go ahead and start removing the screws holding the projector in so hopefully you can see in here there's gonna be half a dozen or so screws to remove here in this center bracket in order to get this projector removed. Okay. I don't think I need to remove these two here. So the two here on this mounting bracket I believe don't need to be removed. And then on this side of the projector, we just need to take a flathead screwdriver and wedge it in here. And then just pop out the projector. And now we have access to the back to the leveling module. And there's a wire clip here. So here's the clip. So here is the leveling module. I've removed the, uh, the, the clip from it. So now we have the projector completely free from the housing. At this point, I just need to go around and looks like there's about another half dozen T20 screws to remove to fully release the, the wire harness. And then up here in the top corner is another little wire clip. Let's see, might just be able to remove this. So up here in the in the top corner was a hidden little circuit board. And should be able to just slide that off. And then from here, missed one more. Okay. So I can slide this wire harness here under the bracket. And now I have the wire harness free. And here, if you want to remove, there's a couple, there's four more T20 screws to remove this inside bracket if you need to. But otherwise, here is the fully disassembled X3 LED headlight. Hope you found this useful, and thanks for watching.